The shift to a greener, healthier planet won't happen overnight, but small steps can lead to big change. For example, let's just say our smartphones lasted one year longer. The benefit to the environment would be the same as taking a million cars off the roads. Changes like this are embodied in the idea of the circular economy. As well as making products last longer, the circular economy is reducing waste and transforming how we use resources. The shift to the circular economy will be driven by business, enabled by governments and backed by finance. Finance is key. Without money, the transition cannot happen. By shifting to a circular economy, we will develop cleaner, more competitive and more resilient businesses. Cleaner because finance can drive companies to circular production, restoring and regenerating soil, improving water and air quality. More competitive, because there will be savings for businesses that avoid waste, as much as 600 billion euros a year in Europe by 2030. More resilient, because reused resources will help shelter businesses from price volatility. Industry can reduce the use of primary materials, such as metals and chemicals, by 32% by 2030 and 53% by 2050. But that doesn't mean growth will stall, far from it. New services and products will inspire startups, foster innovation and create jobs. And by 2030, the disposable income of European households could be as much as 11 percentage points higher if we choose to follow a circular model. Examples of circular economy businesses include leasing a product to customers or offering pay-per-use models. For instance, instead of each of us buying a washing machine to have in our home, we'll rent one and only pay when we use it. When it's no longer working properly, the rental company will replace it, taking the old one away and recycling its materials. The same will happen with other items, from clothes to cars. Moving from ownership to sharing can increase how much a product is used, generating far more value over its lifetime. Finance will support businesses to give customers access to these new circular products and services. At Intesa San Paolo, we have already created a 6 billion funding plafond for circular economy projects at discounted rates. This credit facility has been supporting businesses working in a circular way since 2018. We also launched an award-winning bond focused on the circular economy. As a partner of the Ellen MacArthur Foundation, we've set the bar for financing circular economy businesses. Change takes time and investment. That's why we have put the circular economy at the heart of all our decisions. It's time to step up, not step back.